we are here in Greenpoint, Brooklyn, right on Manhattan Avenue, in between Ash Street and Box Street, for one of New York's best secret, not secret Japanese spots. It's not a five-star Michelin restaurant. It's not a fancy ramen place. It just is good quality home cooking. The name of the place is Ashbox, and I cannot wait to take you there. You're gonna love it. the food I cannot wait to my knowledge it's just this one woman running the place I've never had a home in Japan but it is what I imagine home cooking would be like it is just so filling for the soul I love this place I love this place so much I can't wait <laughs> We have finally got the food. It was less than a five minute wait and it smells so good, even through the mask. Unfortunately, due to COVID, obviously we can't eat in the restaurant. There are a couple of little tables outside, but I've got a better spot right down the road. I'll show you where it's at. down the road. It doesn't look like much, but let me tell you, when you've got some ash box and you're just sitting there next to the canal or river, it's bliss. Let's eat. All right, we've got some unsweetened golden oolong tea. And for the main course, ooh, ooh, ooh. I got two things. This is their tuna poke bowl for those who want to be healthy. Oh, look at that. Oh, it looks so good. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Second, it's a mushroom tofu curry over rice. Oh, you're going to see that steam. It looks like a little cauliflower, some curry, tofu mushrooms, maybe some onions in there. Oh my gosh. This is going to be good. The seagulls are already gathering for the pickings. <laughs> we might have to battle. It's gonna start out with the poke bowl. Again, it's got tuna, avocado, it smells like sesame oil as well, rice, a little bit of what is that? Well, let's just take a bite and find out. Ginger. <laughs> the tuna literally melts in your mouth. It's fresh. It's clean, it's delicious. There's just the slightest taste of sesame due to the oil, brightened up by the ginger. Creaminess of the avocado pairs perfectly with, oh, this tuna. Oh, it's so good, guys. I know the presentation isn't the best because it's in this little cup, but it's kind of fun just to sit outside Looking over the water, we've got Long Island City right across the street. The street right across the, um, the canal. What is this? View of the Empire State Building. Seagulls trying to get my tuna. It's just the entire experience. And to know they're eating food that is freshly made. You can feel the health seeping into your body with every bite. But the thing is, it tastes amazing. I love it. Even the rice looks healthy. It's got beans in there. What is this treat? <laughs> That's good. Let's get to the curry though. Next on to the curry. So here we've got tofu, mushrooms, cauliflower. Here's a pigeon right there. It's trying to get in on this action. It's not gonna happen. And of course the curry, I think there's also some onions. Let's bite into this. Let's take a bite. Let's see. Mm. Immediately warming, hearty curry. There's just the slightest bit of spice, like just a hint, enough. Even if you don't like spice, I think you'll really enjoy this. I can't even tell you about it because I just want to shove it in my face. Napkins, need napkins. 
<laughs> this is good stuff. This is really good stuff. There's just such a peacefulness about the entire experience, which is why I wanted to take you here. And it's difficult to capture on film. Get your ash box, walk two minutes down the street, sit yourself down, and just take a moment for yourself to really appreciate everything you've got. It's just so rare in the city to find these pockets, these moments of tranquility and peacefulness that you can just literally sit down and take a time out and relax. I can't explain it. <laughs> it's food for your stomach and it's food for your soul. I know now is not the time for ice cream, but if you do come up to Greenpoint for Ashbox, you have to just step across the street to the Brooklyn Ice Cream Factory. It is delightful. Well, definitely make sure to swing by Getaway, New York City's first non-alcoholic bar with real cocktails, just minus the alcohol. They are delicious. They also have coffee, little sodas, shrubs, which are kind of like a vinegary drink. Got some little bites to eat. Highly recommend Getaway if you're in the neighborhood. You cannot go wrong. It'll open your mind. <laughs> I'm being walked. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Good luck. Want that swimming pool so badly.
Thank you for joining us on another episode of the Wasabi Apple. We are so grateful and so thankful for your support. We'll leave you with this beautiful image of Manhattan across the river. And we'll see you for another episode of the Wasabi Apple. Let's <laughs> just go. The name of the place is Ashbox, and I cannot. <laughs> I know now it's not really the season for ice cream, but if you do come up to Ashbox, you have to, you have to stop by the Brooklyn Ice Cream Shop factory shit. <laughs> edit that out. <laughs> Big chunky boy. <laughs> <laughs>